Mac Capadonna with the deal. Hey, it ain't no thing but a chicken in the ring, man. I heard it. I heard it. Yeah. Tell me about the new project. Right now, um, I got a couple things going on. For one, uh, you know, I just dropped the Earth, Wind & Fire CD, double CD featuring Lounge Mode. That's like 24 joints on each, on each CD. You know what I mean? And I got various videos out right for them right now, like Creature Feature, uh, Baby Mamas, and, and, and so forth. So you can all check that out. That's popping right now. Um, you can get that too on um, on iTunes. You can check me out on Capadonna or the real Capadonna at Yahoo. You can check me out on. Uh, you can go to Kings and Queens LLC to get that right there. Kings and Queens with a Z and an N in the middle. Queens Z LLC at Gmail or at dot com. Either way, you can get that CD. Furthermore. Okay. You know I've been touring with the clan here and there. We did Coachella, like 80,000 capacity crowd. We rocked out. It was a storm. It was a, it was a sandstorm. We still beat them up. Still rocked them out over there. You know how we do. We the Grateful Dead of Hip Hop. Then we smashed them. Then we smashed them at um at the Bar the Roo. Another 80 grand. Another 80,000 out there capacity and better. We rocked out. We did what we were supposed to do. We just moving around. We also working on the Wu album. You dig? A Better Tomorrow. That's crazy right there. You know, we just need some... I feel like we need some more production, though. I want to reach out to some of my brothers, man. I don't got. We don't got nothing on there from Swiss. I think RZA should do only half of that album. Okay. And the rest should be like okay. Swift Beats, Primo, you know, Primo. Even get one from Puffy, man. Come on. Because, yo, look... Yo, you know we the last Mohegans, right? <laughs> yeah, G, come on. It ain't gonna be no more of this no more. We tried to, everybody tried, even Nas tried to bring it back. Hip hop, the way we knew it, is no longer ever gonna be like that again, G. Know what I mean? So right. it's like, yo, we gotta just keep doing what we doing right now and, and try to keep the foundation of it alive at least. Now, what is, do you guys have a title already for the new Wu Tang album? Yeah, it's a better tomorrow. So far, that's what we got, but it's it's subject to change. Seems as though since we don't have like all of the songs done right now, probably may, maybe not even half the album is done. So it's like we still got chance to time to juggle, switch it up, and change. You know what I'm saying? But for right now, it's definitely a better tomorrow, and we all need to look forward to that. <laughs> Yes, sir. Sure. Yeah. Uh, okay, so so RZA, RZA is doing the majority of the production like usual. Yeah, what yeah. Other, what, other, what other producers do you have locked in already on some songs? I know you mentioned all the ones you want, but what other producers have done tracks right now? I haven't seen nobody yet. I haven't, I haven't seen nobody doing anything for the album yet. So that's why I said we still early with it. You know what I mean? We we was working on it for a while, but then we stopped because of all of the touring and shows that we got to do. Back, you know, we've been also, um, you know, we did Summer Jam. I, I didn't make it to Summer Jam. I didn't make it to the Europe shows. I was taking care of some other red tape and getting ready for also my, um, I'm working on the Pillage 2 album. You know, so I got a chance to also, you know, peek at some other upcoming producers right there too as well so if, so whatever i don't get a chance to in, place my input on the Wu album i'll get that for my album i've been trying i've been wilding out on this pillage 2 album though i've been trying to get charlie murphy and you know just i'm, I'm doing what it would need to be done man i got an old school track new school tracks it's so eclectic just so many different varieties of music i got i got some young producers um some young artists man with me and, uh, and I'm, I'm liking how the energy and the vibe is coming out. But remember, hip hop is evolving right now. So it's like, it, like I said again, you know, we're gonna have to push anything we wanna hear new, we're gonna have to push as a conglomerate to make that stick and make it a, make it a stronghold in hip hop right now, or else there, there ain't gonna be no other sound but that South sound. Yeah. I feel you. I feel That's you. the truth, man. I feel 
on the on the uh, the Better Tomorrow album. Any guest appearances yet? Locked in, or is it still kind of too early? Nah, it's very it's it's very really early. I recorded like four songs. We haven't um been all together recording yet. So um we we've been recording it from L.A. to New York to Jersey. So we all scattered out. We have yet to come together for the real deal yet. But um. I, I did, however, laid about four verses or five verses for, you know, some of the upcoming music. And I did lay a verse for um, the Family Reunion track that's out right now. But um, I guess it didn't make it to the playoffs. Because I ain't hear it on the yeah. track. You're in business with Def Jam and you're helping them sell records. Universal, you're helping them sell records. So what exactly is it for sale, Kanye? <laughs> I don't get it. I'm confused. You know, don't be, you know, fake revolutionary for profit. I enjoyed it. It was awesome. I wish I would have uh, been a part of it. All right, so do you enjoy the Eve Stevie It was it was pretty it was pretty alright. I had I had fun watching it. 